走。Hey, how's it going, everyone? This is Ito, and we're playing Sam and Max Hit the Road again today. Do not adjust your monitors. What you are seeing is perfectly normal. <laughs> this is the way the game is. So we're still at this weird place, trying to figure sure out is crinkly what door here. to go through. Crinkly, but boring. Okay, so it's not the red door. I thought it was the red door. So, wait, wait, wait. I'm pretty sure it's not the little one, and I remember it not being the big one, so I think it's this, this orange one here. So let's go back into this weird mirror place. <laughs> Through the portal. And I remember the key to this place is you gotta make the magnets make the color of the door to get through that door. So I think we want to make it orange in here. That's purple. There's another magnet hidden over here. I think that's orange. That looks pretty orange to me. Yellow. That's a yellow magnet. That's a red one. Yellow and red make orange. Let's try that out. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's not this one. Can we get to it? Oh, it's looking good. That doesn't sound good, though. <laughs> I don't think you want any noises to play. Stop turning nope. your head inside out, Max. I can't. Let's leave. It's very rude, Max. Don't do that in public. Okay, can we get through this one then? This is the one I think it's at, so... Come on, move faster. Oh, we can't, sweet. <laughs> oh... Hurry up, Max. Look at all the cheese! Oh, it's not I didn't this think one. They could do that. Really? Can we get through this door? I remember it not being this white one. I can't reach the ah. doorknob. <laughs> the duck noise is starting to irritate me. I've heard it a few too many times. Hey, there's a crossbow there? No, that's part of the mirror. It looked like a bow for a second. Okay, white door. Um, I guess let's turn them all on. Wow, that's bright. Alright, I think that's white. Or cream colored, anyway. So now we can't get through this one, right? I can't reach the doorknob. Okay, let's try it. So this is the only one we haven't been through, so it must be it. Unless there's something else we need to do before coming to this area, but I don't remember anything. Oh, it is it. Cool. Who are you? <laughs> I'm Sam. He's Max. We bust punks, and we're overachievers. That's cool, man. He's I'm Shavul. <laughs> what do you want with me? Hey, Sam, look! <laughs> well, this bottled water is a real letdown. Okay. I need your help. What do we help do? is my middle name. Or maybe it's Star Child. What do you know about Bruno? Bruno the Bigfoot? Why do people keep asking that question? Bruno and I go way back. I've always felt a special kinship with Bigfoots. I feel the same way about pointy sticks. <laughs> I haven't thought about Bruno for years. 
Allow me a moment to karmically link myself to him. If you must. He's got a lot going on his, in Hold his life, on. you know. I'm getting something. Doesn't have time I to see see about I Frog Rock between Mount Badrich and the world's largest stump. Wait, man. Bruno's in trouble. It's like several voices screaming out in terror and then suddenly silenced. Sorry, guys, but I can't get a clear psychic image of Bruno. The sad truth is that I haven't been able to concentrate very well since I lost my mood ring in the biggest ball of twine in the world. If you find it for me, maybe I can help you. Oh, I forgot about this thing. Can you repeat that bit about your missing mood ring again? Okay, man. No, 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 I repeat. lost it in the biggest ball of twine Escape. in the world. Escape. I think he's trying to tell us something, Sam. Oh, good. It was short. <laughs> well, I guess that's all, right, all for now. you gotta find his ring. Make yourself at home. How could you run on a hamster wheel? Day after day and not think about Bruno the Bigfoot. Like, is he that focused on what he's doing? Okay. <laughs> I like the, the melting clock. There's a lot of uh, painting references in this game. Okay, so biggest ball of twine. Biggest ball of twine. And we gotta go to this building. And we use one of the items we got from Gator Golf here. We gotta put the fish onto That this. might be a good idea, but I'll need something to hold the magnet on the end of the retriever. Right, right, right. Okay, we'll use the hand. The hand is still stuck in the jar. The hand is still stuck in the jar. Oh, man. <laughs> um... Oh, oh darn. Okay, we missed the step here. We gotta go back to Smutty's to get the hand out of the jar. Pretty sure. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. Okay. <laughs> There's lots of steps to doing a single task in this game. Oh, it's Snutty's, not Smutty's. I gotta go to the bathroom. Go, go, go. Clean up in aisle four. <laughs> um. Are you in charge here? Don't I wish. I'd have to go to Snucky You for another six years before I could run this place. But enough about me. What can I do for you? Now let's do the bathroom My little thing. buddy has to use the facilities. Facilities be damned. I need a bathroom. <laughs> Here in the back. Here's the key. There's an awfully big rasp attached to that keychain. Out of toilet paper? No, nah, we just had problems with thugs stealing our restroom keys. They're the cleanest in nine counties. The keys? The restrooms. You need some help, little buddy? I think I can handle this myself, Sam. Now, anything else I can do for you? Uh, okay, there's no option for Nothing. it. Nothing. You have no idea how often I hear that. I guess we just gotta give it to him. And here you go. Hey, can you open this for me? Sure. Ain't a jar made I can't open. You got this. You got this. Come on. <laughs> Woohoo! Ooh, that's creepy. Okay, I think we're done here. Actually, we gotta get outside quickly before Max returns. Oh, he's coming back. Don't do it. Max! Max! Are you as confused as I am? More so! Ah, that's a lot of options. I think we should keep the rasp. You're probably right. No one deserves to use restrooms that clean. <laughs> awesome. Well, that's all. Thank you. It's a rasp. And now we can take the hand, put it on. 
pick the fish, put that on. There we go. Whew. That's what we need. So now we can go back to the biggest ball of twine. Get the mood ring. And then, I think that unlocks a new place. Yeah, okay, so we take this, we use it on the ball twine. <laughs> that was wholesome. Not to mention physically improbable. And we got the ring. Woohoo! He gave that guy gave us a dirty look there. I say we're probably about half done the game at least. It's not a very long game. Vortex. We still need to get uh, the vortex from this place and fill the snow globe somehow. But I don't remember where to get the cork. Is this going to remember what we set the magnets to? Can we get through right away? Come on, come on, come on! Yes! Hurry up, Max! Come on! You're back! And we're bigger than a bread box. Three bread boxes, even! What do you want now? Your ring, man. Is this your ring? <laughs> cool, man! Have you found Frog Rock yet? No. But I don't see how finding it's going to get me any closer to finding Bruno. Finding Frog Rock's only the beginning, man. Once you're at Frog Rock, you'll need some samples. Samples? Yeah, man. Bigfoot samples. You know, fur and stuff. Three of them. Smear them all over Frog Rock. Put the fur on the rock. Got it. Let's go, Max. Wait. You'll also need some Mystic Mole Man powder. You must be joking. Mm -hmm. No joke, man. Here, I'll get you some. <laughs> Here you go. Sprinkle this Mystic Mole Man powder over the fur when you've smeared it all over Frog Rock. What'll happen then? Something wonderful. Whoa. Thanks. Easy Let's guy. Go, Max. Okay, so I didn't unlock Frog Rock. I guess we gotta go back to the ball of twine again. What do you give us? He gave us it's this. a charming decanter filled with vile and mysterious liquids. It could be my long lost twin brother, Sam. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, we need to unlock Frog Rock. Let's get out of here. Keep going, keep going. Go back to the ball of twine. Can we make this thing? Oh, come on, hurry, hurry, hurry. Go, go, go. I think we're good. Walk so slowly, though. Oh, yeah, plenty of time. Take a leg, Max. Cool. So we had this all set up before. I don't know why I couldn't find the place before. Remember that thing we did with the... Go inside. With the binocular here. Let's look through this again. It's a conveniently located pair of mounted binoculars. Use it, then. Okay, so we gotta find Frog Rock. It's a rock. Is it Frog Rock? <laughs> a 
It's the inexplicable valley of lights. Oh lights. no, how do you find frog rock if you can't It's a rock. If you can't use this thing. There's some some other trick to this yet. It's a rock. Is there a zoom? Oh man. Hmm. That's the Enchanted Argyle Forest. Okay, you said it was between that and the stump. It's a rock. Which means it's probably this one, right? Why, it's the eternal plain of acid rain. Huh. It's a rock. Hmm. That's the stump. The largest stump in the world. Hmm. It's a rock. Oh. And it's between the two things Shavul said it was between. It must be frog rock. Yay! <laughs> okay, so I guess there's a lot of fake rocks in the mix. I think I can see frog rock. Let's go to frog rock. That had me worried. I completely had no idea what to do there. Man, we got a lot of junk. <laughs> a lot of junk in our inventory here. <laughs> if I was a detective, that's what I would do. I'd just pick up every random object I could and use it to solve the case. Uh, rock. Very small area. Just a rock. This doesn't look like a frog at all. No. My innocence has been shattered by this blatant tourist trap. I want my money back. We didn't pay anything. Well, somebody better give me some money. <laughs> Here you go, Max. Is this I one? can't use these oh, things. Oh, come on. Ever. He just asked for it. Okay, so we got to take all these hair samples we got from different Bigfoots. Spread them on the rock. <laughs> Thanks for your assistance, Max. Uh, take this one. Mm. All right. Grow, Sam. Sticky. And finally, we take the powder. Well? Wait for it. Here it is. Sure gets dark quickly around here. I don't think this is a natural occurrence, Max. In fact, I think we're witnessing a celestial convergence of some sort. Do you think it'll make that rock look more like a frog? Uh-huh. <laughs> this means something, Sam. All right, another place unlocked. What is it, Bumpusville? <laughs> All right, here we go. <laughs> Headquarters of the villains. It's a Conroy world after all. If we ever get this rich and famous, I want you to shoot me, Sam. It'll be a pleasure. I don't think, uh, yeah, I don't think you can get inside, can you? Oh, you can. 
Okay. Nice place. Bumpusville is proud to present the master of melody, the king of country, Mr. Entertainment, Conroy Bumpus. I hate floor shows. I remember my childhood in Brighton When dear old dad would bounce me on his knee oh, It's terrible He'd say, son, there ain't nothing as exciting As exposing beasts to inhumanity That's why I'm <laughs> Happy to be king I'm proud to be the lord of the old I love collecting things with grotesque features It makes me feel like some child and god <laughs> Calm down This guy's got so moves I trapped my first tiger before I could speak Killed me a bear when I was free And now with this I finally have a full menagerie. Hit it, boys! Wow. This is definitely different with audio. <laughs> um, so here's Bruno and Trixie. We finally found them. Hey, Trixie. <laughs> oh, they can't talk even. Hey, Bruno. <laughs> Oh, I think if we go across. Oh, he won't even walk across. Uh oh, oh yeah. What's the name of Jethro Clampett's going on here? Ow! Knock it off! Help! Aye! <laughs> and stay out. Oh, uh, things get tougher at this part of the game. Okay. Oh yeah, the well. I forgot A about the well. A wishing well. I wish I had absolute power to decide who lives and who dies. I think we'd need a bigger well. So what you do, you take the money. I wish this game were over. And thanks, Hold it. thanks for watching everyone. Get back here. <laughs> We're dealing with a very literal well here. <laughs> oh, anyway, I think we're going to end this episode here at the very least. So thank you for watching, guys. We will continue again next time. And uh, I'll see you then. Bye-bye. <laughs>